Ooh, what's up guys, and welcome to a very different episode. Uh, due to Halloween, I really want to, you know, get in that Halloween theme, but realize that with Pokemon like Gorgeist, that, that, that is as far as we will go, and that really sucks, so we're actually going to try something different. So I'm going to talk about the Pokemon that do scare me the most. And uh, before I even start this off, <laughs> as you see, I'm hiding something behind this. Um, I'm going to show you two Pokemon that do scare me naturally. And also three Pocket Fusion with a fine simulating. The thing is here, in a world where everything is cuddly, uh, you know, we got stuff that are just very, very like squishy and cute in general. There are things that are disturbing, and for most parts, it's actually kind of nice. The things that are supposed to be scary, like the ghost Pokemon, don't necessarily scare me at all. They have a, like a disturbing, uh, um, disturbing entries, I guess, in the Pokedex. But besides that, you know, Pokemon like Banet doesn't really intimidate that much. Mr. Mime. There's where we go. With, with the design choices, makes me makes us scarce. And uh, I'm gonna start with the one Pokemon I find most intimidating. For the people who follow me on Twitter, knows exactly what this Pokemon is, and that is Deswalot. Just look at this thing. Just look at it. How the hell is this? You know, I don't even know where to start. I just, I don't, I mean, this thing looks like, and minding you for actually being a bit scary, but I played a lot of weird games back in the days, uh, for different reasons, this is looks like something from those kind of games, um, and you know, a, a Google search did not really, really help, this thing, that wide mouth, is quite disturbing. It definitely is eating things. Uh, it seems to devour things, really. And, and together with being poisonous, bleh, <laughs> it's just disturbing. And the next picture here showing that it eats a Pikachu or is that it's a Raichu. And uh, I find this disturbing. It actually is really, really, really scary. And like I said, I won't show you the worst of Google. But Google is Pokemon definitely, you know, it brought back that general feel I was talking about before. It's made for something different, and it's not okay. It's definitely disgusting. And I just find this thing so unnerving. It's so just, ugh. So when I see that thing in battle, I tend to, you know, shrug a bit. I like using it myself, because it gives me that vibe of power. It's a worthless Pokemon in all fashion, if anything. But, my god, is it scary. Yeah, I don't like this Pokemon one bit because of that. I really find this thing intimidating and super, super scary. And I don't want to do anything with it. Now, the next Pokemon is a very, very obvious one. Hypno. Yeah, it's not like this was a surprise. Hypno is... Well, all the stores with that, together with that long nose and, you know, stuff like that. It... It just awakes something that is, um, it's not for this world, it's, <laughs> I'm trying to find the right word, but it all comes down to that very fashion that, you know this thing is up to something, it feels evil, its presence is very, very evil, so I'm glad it's not a good Pokemon in that fashion, because it has the scare factor already, and I'll leave it at that. I'll definitely leave it at that. I don't have, like, the weird stories to tell anybody about Hypno. I always find it pretty creepy when I was young. And I never used it. But it didn't help with all the creepy past around it. It has that, like I said, an aura. Like, it feels naturally evil. And uh, that's never a good thing. <laughs> so those are two Pokemon that freaks me out. I mean, for 718 Pokemon, uh, only two freaks me out. That's actually a good thing. Even though Swallow definitely triumphs Hypno. And now I have three Pokemon Fusion, which really, really... I've seen them. I thought it was really scary. I thought it was scary enough to save them. And I actually got used for them. I never thought I would. First one... Polyrath. Yeah, ju just Polyrath in general is super scary. Um, so yeah, it's not a Fusion. It actually is a regular Polyrath. So I'm sorry about that. 
I forgot to tell you guys that Polarad is also a very, very nasty Pokemon. And this picture just freaks me out. It definitely does. I mean, that at least explains the mouth. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> it's fucking scary! It's like a big... It's not even a toe, right? It still is... Yeah, I still think it's like a like a frog form, like, you know, the youngster, the, 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 the gro groolings, I don't know the English word for it, but this picture really freaks me the fuck out. Um, and actually, this is how I see polarized in general. I see it as more buff poly, poly world, and that is not necessarily a good thing, because poly world is super strange. And polarized being buffer, <laughs> I like Polar as a Pokemon though, I think it's really cool, but, um, you know, if you would see it in reality, it probably looks something like this, and that's fucking scary. <laughs> Alright, so there are two fusions, I'm sorry about that, the first one being very, very obvious, the Suba Chansey. Just, just look, <laughs> oh, it's so fucking weird. The thing is here, you know, it's... <laughs> it sprouts or it's hair from chance it turns its little wings together with glimpsy feet and you know an egg there a po probably poisonous and it's just a mouth I don't I don't like it I think it looks really 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 creepy and I don't like that one bit and the next one is Gengar Vaporeon yes look at this what if Eevee got you know a ghost evolution you know, this is as close as we would get with that. I really believe this thing is just out of this world. It just looks so evil. A very nice job, you know, the person that did this. I mean, it could even go for a poison type, I believe. But, <laughs> my god, is that thing scary. Uh, <laughs> get the fuck out of here. So, yeah, that will actually be, you know, all of it. I hope you guys enjoy this. Like I said, it's filler content today, and it's just because I really want to get in that Halloween feel, but we also recognize that, you know, you can only make so many Gore Guys videos, uh, i rather, you know, share this info with you. Like I said, Swalot, you like, general, uh, a genuine you from me. If you use this thing against me, then we're, we're gonna have issues together. Uh, I think this, th this thing just freaks me out. I think it's super, super Super scary, don't you?